Hello there guys, and well, welcome back to Let's Play Animal Force, English wrong, English translated, some last stuff, I'm gonna go ahead and pick up my two items, I have Flash, uh, um, got corrupted, so I'm gonna have to make another flash, uh, <laughs> please tell me I can move forward with the other one. So you're back again. Today. Very good, yes. Very reliable. Well, let's get to work. Uh oh, you got me off. So you have to? Okay. Okay, you know. So let's go talk to our villagers. I don't even know why I'm heading down here. This way first. Oh, I hate this music. Okay, no, I don't. I don't hate it per se. It's good. It's good. Very good. Hey, Apollo. Apollo. Hey, <laughs> Were you crashed out all day? Or what? Well, each person has their own lifestyle, I suppose. Some are better than others. So then, why are you here? Can I help you out? Alright, as, as a matter of fact, I do have a little something for you to do. All you have to do is take this messy piece of cake, huh? Kids would. See this masses is too far. <laughs> Don't know what that means. But it somehow ended up at my place. Yeah, I know it's not the most interesting favor, but what do you want from me? Well, will you do it? Oh. Okay, that's all I have to say. Get a move on. So we gotta go deliver this to Marcy. And yes, I'm not saying Mercy, like it was the other day. It's Marcy. Sorry. <laughs> no, I'm joking. Um, I have no idea what my riches are in this game. Because I've played so long. Yeah, my, um. Somehow my other. My flash file got corrupted, but yet I can't delete a house either because that will also crash the game. So I'm just gonna go ahead and create a file and leave flash to die. <laughs> that sounds mean and all. Do I want to? No, not really, because I love enjoying playing this game and <laughs> I really don't want to start another profile. But if I have to, that's what I have to do. Mm. So I might take this this game or this can't be. Um Oh my god, we have an anteater. Zoe! Oh dear, nice to meet you. I think. I'm not I'm not used to call at this hour. In any case, my name is Zoe. Do we know each other? I'm sorry if I don't remember you. Oh, is this the first time we've met? Then, yep. I thought so. I don't normally forget faces. And your name is Andrew. Well, charmed to meet you. I hope my mic is okay, guys, because my mic's been really crappy lately. Kinda sucks. Right. Yes. If only, if only. <laughs> mm. 
if I do I can? Not really. I can I could easily get a like a Logitech or headphone that has like the pro import so I can listen to me you know, listen to the game music and all that, but hey, I mean this setup really doesn't work, but it works. That was a negative positive that didn't work. Why am I looking around for it? I have a map, dude. <laughs> okay, so I have to go down from here. See, I know which house I was looking for. Hey, what? Watch it, Speedy. If I didn't... Didn't ha have, like, lightning quick reflexes, I would have walled in here. Say, huh? Craziness. Why, it's Andrew. Be more careful from now on, okay? Yeah. Hey, did you want something or what? Um, delivery. Delivery! Delivery! Sorry. That's weird. It's a watch. Is that, um, excuse me, but is that my, uh, bubble? Why in the wide world do you have it, on? Oh, duh. So that's what this is all about. Paul asked you to return it to me, huh? Wow, that's like a... So... Helpful. Thanks a ton, yo. I wanted to thank you, so I got some furniture just for you. Hey, awesome. And it's nice to know that there are people like you willing to go the extra mile. Oh... Uh, is Marcy, is Marcy gonna be my, my creeper in this, in this town? Oh, I always have a creeper. <laughs> I'll be right back, guys. I just heard something. Sorry, I must be hearing things. <laughs> okay, I'm sorry. I got really paranoid there for a second. So, but whatever, I mean. It's a happy day in Animal Crossing. What's up, Hazel? We haven't talked much. Nice evening, don't you agree? Say, this is the first time I've seen you today, isn't it? What on earth have you been doing all the... All the... <laughs> live long day? Playing NES? Aww! So you must have had some reason for coming to see me, right? Oh, well, give me one. Thanks for asking, really, though. I can't think of any work for you. It's nice of you to ask. Oh, I want to do some more work for Hazel. Mm. I feel sad. Whatever. <laughs> I, let's just go back to this place. I always forget what these are. What my hell's are in this one. No, I think the only reason why it's got these like weird transitions this weird transition and all that transitioning things is because I don't think they could handle it. I don't think the uh Were you able to help anybody out? Many animals need things. Huh? Did you get anything good in return? Put it in town and all fairly generous. So your work never goes unrewarded. That's quite nice, yes? Next, I need you to deliver a nice carpet for me, yes? But don't dilly-dally along the way. Take this carpet to Olivia. Hey, we haven't seen her today. Yes, just because I'm not watching you doesn't mean you... You can stop and chit-chat with folks you meet along the way. Then again, there's no way I can keep tabs on you. Just try not to gab too much. Tell me when you're done. <laughs> oh, Nook. So our trees are grown. 
Polygon because <laughs> I, I didn't play for a while. Well, actually, no, it was, it was yesterday, wasn't it, that I recorded this? I can't remember, but the but I know last episode is going up today. It went up today. Uh, good evening. You must have had a long day today. Excuse me. We're just getting started. Good gracious! By the way, did you need something? Delivery. I promised him now we're saying. I, I won't sing that every time. You were... Have you been... If you'd... Take one minute longer, I would... Lodge a complaint with Tom. I went to a lot of trouble to find this carpet. It perfectly matches the sheer... Elegance of my room. Most common folk don't know this. But you simply have to have carpeting and wallpaper that set each other off. Just by the looks of, of you, I bet your wallpaper and rug look positively awful. Put on. What the fuck? I'm sure even the, even the ratty old car carpet I've been using would make your room, room look much better. Of course, even this carpet may be too glamorous for a hovel like the one you decided to inhabit. You must make do with what you have, no matter how pathetic you may be. Look for rugs at Nick's shop. He's always changing his products line, so you never know when you might find something spectacular. Of course, you're working. Working and Tom's and Tom won't sell anything to his employees. Not certainly a thorny issue. Hurry up and pay off your house. Then at least I won't have to feel so embarrassed to see Aww. Okay. Whatever. <laughs> still had a crush on Flash whenever, whenever we left the, the Japanese part. Yeah, so, unfortunately, Flash's house is going away for a while. By the way, if you haven't played in a while, you, have car you will have co cockroaches hiding in furniture and all that. But, since he doesn't have much... Since he doesn't have anything, they're not hiding in furniture. Okay. So, let's go talk to Nick. Because I don't feel the need to talk to, uh, Olivia anymore. Welcome back, dear employee. Very good, yes? It looks like you're finally getting the hang of thing things around here. The way you work, I'd be happy to have you working here full time. Wouldn't that be a treat? Hmm? In any case, I can see you're putting a lot of effort into your work. So this time I'll give you 580 bells. Next, I need you to deliver an axe to Dobby. Be extra careful with it. Hmm. I see that light in your eyes. Now, the stuff you deliver is wrapped. So you couldn't use it, even if you you wanted to. So don't get any ideas. Hmm? If you want to cut down any trees, you'll have to get your own axe. Very good then. Give it your best shot. And tell me when you're done. Yes. Okay. So one thing I kind of want to show, or <laughs> I'm gonna show off right here. It's kind of funny. I don't know if it's going to be in English or not, but if you go ahead and, like, put on something. Like that. Ah! Why did you change out of your uniform, hmm? Just who gave you permission to do that? I'm wondering. 
I swear, what is it with kids these days, hmm? Always needing a casual workplace. Why, when I was a young, we... I suppose I must change with the times, yes? Go on with your hip hippiness. Wear whatever you like. But, you can't wear anything that might make my customers feel uncomfortable. Yes? Oh, at this point, I won't... I won't budge. That's just the way society works. You understand? Sometimes you have to obey the rules, yes? Well, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Nook. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to switch out. No, I really didn't. So I'm going to go ahead and switch back in my uniform because it looks a lot better than the stuff I have. And it, it's, it's just kind of cool. folk, aren't you? <laughs> the creature of night. Of the night. Oh, when I was young. What am I saying? No, no. Come on, old lady yet. I've still got some kicks left in me. Hey, did you want something or what? Oh, oh that was so cute. Oh my god, she's getting a letter. <laughs> Thinking about writing her letter. Oh my god, that was so adorable. Oh, wow, thank you. You're the coolest. Hey, wait, I'm such a space cadet. I was going to ask, are you are you the one who sent me this letter? Everyone in this town just loves getting that is, we save every single one, yeah? And you know what else? The only thing better than getting letters is showing them off. Yeah? And like, even though we all live in part now, who knows when somebody might move? I mean, you know, when I move, I'm probably gonna bring a good letter on every gotten with me. And you know, sometimes something probably show them to my new friends in my new town. Yep. It could happen, so if I, I were you, I wouldn't write anything too embarrassing. Okay, okay. Yes, yes. Oh, yes, very good. Yes. Now, let's see. That sure earned you a solid 230 bells. Do you... Mm, your next job will be... Ah, yes. Now I remember. You've seen the bulletin board in front of your, of your house, haven't you? Well, I want you to write an, an ad for my shop on that bulletin board. You get foot traffic around there, yes? You can write whatever catchy, catchy slogan you like. Just make sure it sounds exciting, hmm? And don't write anything that might embarrass you. Embarrass me. Once you write something on, on it, you can never erase it. Well, off you go. Hmm? And let me know when you're all done, yes? So, we're almost done here, and then I think I'm, I'm gonna end out the video, video because, truthfully, I didn't mean to make that first part in 44 minutes. Oh my god, that was so long. Even longer to edit in. Oh god. Hey. 
Hey, awesome. Spring is upon us. Flowers and warm te temperatures are, are prelude summer. Come see the blossoms. Join us April 5th through the 7th in the w Wishing Well P Plaza for the So, I'll cut out whenever I get a good, uh, letter. Yep, I know it's simple, but hey, what can you do, okay? Okay, so, let's head back to the next shop and, well, what time is it? 8.47, it's not even close. I've only been recording for 15 minutes. Welcome back. Did you put a buzz generating ad up there? Something animals will take, talk about over the watch, water cooler. Very good, yes, I suppose. Hmm, I mean... Yes, you're all done. All the work I had in gotten around to is now all done. How wonderful for me. Hmm? Since I don't have any more work for you you to do, I'm afraid I have no choice but to let you go. The rest of your mortgage? Oh, of course. You still have to pay all the all of it off. That's how life works. Let me just have a look at my records here. Hmm, yes, yeah, so far you've you've worked off about a total of thousand four hundred or one thousand four hundred bells or fourteen hundred bells. So you have seventeen thousand four hundred bells left to pay. Not exactly some is some to sneeze at. at. Hmm? Since there's no more work for you here, you'll have to figure out how to pay it off on your own. Now, how could a youngster go about making some bells? I suppose running errands for the villagers and selling things you no longer need, too. Hmm. That should generate some cash flow, I should think. If you got stuff to sell, just come talk to me, yes? I'll give you a very fair price for anything you've got. Oh, when you want to make a mortgage payment, do it at the post office for me. Tax purposes, you know. If you can pay off about a thousand dollars a week, that'll work for me. Otherwise, I'll send you... I'll send for the raccoon goons. Oh, <laughs> just a joke. Once you pay it all. All off, we can talk about remodeling the place for you. That house you've got now is pretty small, after all, and I'm sure you'd like a little more room, yes? Well, thanks for your help. I hope you'll come see me for all of your furniture shopping needs. Hmm? Yes! I'm finally done working! I'm free! I'm free! Oh my god, this music is 
so amazing. You know what? The only person we haven't talked to is Boots today. Oh, and Claude. I can't even for I forgot about Claude. Let's go talk to Claude. Whoops. Let's go talk to Claude. Well, we're going to see the inside of Claude's house. Yay! It has... Comrade KK in it. Okay, he's very... His house is kind of creepy, but... Hey, Andrew. Looks like somebody wants to s scoop out my paid, my paid, my pad for interior design tips. Hey, look, looking free. I don't know. mind in the least. Emit my style till the cows come home. Hmm? What's up? Okay, chat. I'd be pretty blown away if you hadn't noticed this wild tooling around fart, but we have a huge number of tasty poop bearing trees around these parts. I guess I don't hurt to tell you this, that fruit could be yours. Just place a tree and press the A button. Don't shake the tree, but, but good. And all that snack plastic fruit will be yours for the taste. Chat on on it, or if you're not hungry, just sell it at the old Nook shop. That dude, dude'll pay anything. Uh, buy anything. Oh, you can also plant fruit in the ground, and a new tree will grow on it. New tree's awesome like that. Now, now that I think of it, about it a little. If you did something about where you plant fruit, you could start your own orchard. No, I think. since we just met them yesterday. Now, unfortunately, we won't be able to do anything about this yet. The shiny thing on the ground. Wait, I want to make a joke. I'm God! Fear me! I kid. I love Animal Crossing. Well, apparently we're too late to go see Boots. Unless he's in his house, which I don't... Oh, what's he got playing? It has KK Arrera. Well, you should turn it off. Hey, how's it going? Listen, I was wondering... Have you made some good friends? Is that so? Well, good. That's much. It's true. Huh? Better is a neighbor nearby than a brother far away? Well, actually, brothers are pretty important. Near or far. And, s and far off pals, too. What same bites? Tell me, Andrew, what's new? Talk to me. Yeah, if you bury fruit, it'll g sprout and grow. Uh, I've already heard this. Come on. Don't be Mr. Tutorial. 
I'll explain this on my own. Wait, there's a bunch of gear I want to buy, but I gotta save up some serious coinage before I can afford it all. Not like that's a, that's a huge deal or anything. There's more ways to earn money than you can believe. I mean, I usually go and catch some fish, but, oh. Um, okay, so Boots is gonna be like a a tutorial fiend, but whatever. Ooh. So, the shrine. What errand have you at? The shrine of thought. How are things? In areas where there is very little green. there because I could do these things. Okay. I have no idea what he's talking about. Okay, whatever. Someone can message me about the shrine. Go ahead. talk to some of the other animals because we haven't really chatted with them. Dottie! You're so much better than Olivia! What's up? You know what I was wondering the other day? I th you think Tom Nook makes any money at that store? But before he was all allowed to make lots of money so I can like Build a better, a bigger store and stuff. And if he's racking it in, I wonder just how big a store he's thinking of building. And right now, if I buy lots of stuff from Tom, maybe we'll make, get a bigger store soon. She is actually kind of foreshadowing something that we can do later. Which, you'll see. Boy, I didn't expect you again. Hello there. Bye bye. Did you need something? Entertain me, bitch. How come I haven't gotten a letter from you, from you yet? You do know about the post that I miss. Leave me alone, Olivia. Please. It's 9 o'clock, and this is probably the best 
music in this game, hands down. Maybe besides another track, which I'll show off later, but... Hmm? Oh, it's just Andrew again, right? So, what do you want? No mistake. Oh, whatever. Oh, dude. Whatever. That's alright. Welcome. Do come in. Have a look around. Hmm? Feel free to browse, but try not to... To care us. Oh, well. Thank you. Do come again. I look forward to seeing you. So we have no we know we have no bells. Pure and simple. But so <sighs> well, I think we should go into my house. Okay, it's getting pretty late. It's actually not nine o'clock, I kinda bullshit it. It's kinda like eleven o'clock right now. Looks like kinda wanted to hear the awesome music. Such a freaking stickler. I'm sorry. Okay, so we don't have much room, and I think, actually, tomorrow. I'm gonna place some of my stuff. Ooh, this plant's kinda nice. Let's just move that over by the door. I don't like its polygonal waste, but I'll get over the polygonal graphics. Heck, even the GameCube looks really polygonal. And some golf clubs. I don't, I don't like the golf clubs. I'm sorry. For the people who play golf, I'm sorry. <laughs> that fits for now, so... I'm gonna keep it. So, and then an animal next time on Animal Crossing N64 English dub. We will be learning how to do bell or make bells or make bells in thought. See you guys in the next episode.